Brayden. My car is back. She's currently getting towed. Um, if you don't remember, but when I was getting Megan um, from the airport, someone we were at in Disney, my car had to be like shipped somewhere else because um, there wasn't a place near us like that specialized on Land Rover. So we had to ship it off and now it's back to that. I'm sorry, I'm so excited. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have said I'm like home alone, but whatever. You know what I used to say when I'm scared when I'm home alone? I always say out loud, I'm not the one. I'm just not. Like, I'm not. Like, ghost murderers. Uh-uh. I'm not it. I'm not her. I can... gonna cover my license plate but like look at her oh Loki we're not going for a car ride my trash being in here that I left in here that's kind of funny oh she's so cute oh my god wait no let me open the back it's like I'm getting my car for the first time like Oh, I got a new camera too. Oh, wow. They put new handles in. I don't know what. Looks like they kept this. I'm in my car again. <laughs> Time to play by. You know when you're driving a new car, you're like, oh, wow, it drives so smooth. It drives so nice. And then... After a while, it's your car, so you get used to it. And like, I remember the first time driving my first car and it being like super sensitive, you know, like the gas is sensitive, the wheel is sensitive. And since I haven't driven this in a while, everything feels like sensitive again. And like, whoo, right, let's step on the gas. I'm just kidding, I just got my car back. I don't need it to go away anytime soon. I'm gonna jam out to some music right now. I don't really get copyrighted, so. <sighs> All right, I'm trying to grow my natural hair color back, so yeah, I've gone that far. This is like dyed. It's my natural brunette. Do -do 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 -do. Vlog. I'll go get a snack first. I did a lot this morning. It's literally only 10:43. I don't know if you can see that. So recap my morning. I woke up at like seven. Let Loki out. And by the way, my mom's out of town right now, so the house is just me. For a week it's been like that kind of like the past month my mom's been kind of going back and forth between texas and here so and i've had to stay here with the dog no complaints i love when i have that to myself made myself breakfast and then took him for a walk then did laundry and then i took a shower and i just blew out my hair and now I'm here and I'm about to do my makeup for the first time in forever. I clean my makeup brushes. Thank me later. Okay. Going in with my flawless filter because I love her. 
Oh my god, this feels so weird. Okay, we're just going in. We're just going. Yep, we're just gonna go. It's so funny. I don't know why I just had this thought. I used to be like, okay, let's talk about random things. Okay? Okay. And maybe you'll get to know me a little bit better. Um, I remember being in high school and like my guy friends. Okay, everyone came to my house in high school. <sighs> Worst decision of my life. I don't know why I let people come over to my house. Um, <laughs> literally traumatizing like having everyone always at your house it was awful like so bad the things you do to fit in really it's like let's be like real like we're like i'm gonna be real okay the things you do to fit in it's just not worth it but you know i had to learn one way or the other but anyways i would have like my guy friends over or you know whatever and I would need to be doing my makeup and I would get embarrassed to do my makeup in front of them like look like this like in front of them is that so weird I find that very odd because like now hell no I would not care if like a guy like why was I embarrassed? I don't know. It was weird. It was kind of like how people, you know how some girls like are embarrassed to eat in front of guys? Yeah, I wasn't that girl. I was embarrassed to do my makeup. <laughs> what? Like make it make sense. Oh my god, I haven't used this brush in so long. I forgot how much I like it. I would use a beauty blender, but um, all mine were dirty, so I had to throw them out. So I'm just using this Morphe M439 brush. I'm using the zip work. That's funny. Sorry. I like can't take myself seriously sometimes. Like, I make everything into a joke, but that's fine. <sighs> Usually I go pretty heavy on warming up my face, but I think I'm gonna switch it up and just like do my cheeks. Usually I put like my contour one. I'm not really contouring, I'm just bronzing up my face. But you know what I'm saying. Like I usually put that here, 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 and my nose. But today I'm not trying to be like cakey. I'm just trying to be like looking cute. Can we talk about this Mario brush real quick? <laughs> Mario. It's the F3 brush. Mm hmm He said, he said duality. He said, you can do anything with this brush. He said, everything in your makeup routine. Honestly, like, I feel like I could truly do my whole routine with just this brush. Obviously, I'd have to, like, kind of clean it in between. But this brush, like, the blending, oh my gosh. Beauty Blender could never. Like, that's insane. I'm going in with my Morphe setting powder with my little poof. I put these on my Amazon storefront, so these are amazing. Like, it's kind of like a smoothing tool for me. Like, I just feel like they make me look so much smoother than if I were to apply powder with a brush. Like, I just feel like it is like a filter on my skin. Highly recommend these. But yeah, they're on my Amazon storefront. So go check it out. Okay, listen to this transition. It's Two, one. Need I explain more? Like Taylor Swift, Lana Del Rey, Harry Styles. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, this 
Charlotte Tilbury palette. Did I fall out of line? I keep thinking maybe if you let me back in. <sighs> so bad that I'm already excited to take this off. <laughs> crazy how much, like, it really is crazy how much you can change. Honestly, in short periods of times, or it's like, okay, I've changed so much in a year, and that seems so long, but it's like really not. Like, I don't know, like I used to go to, like I used to wear makeup almost every day, even if I wasn't doing anything, and then I would fall asleep with my makeup. Yeah. Now, the thought of falling asleep in my makeup is a no for me. But I think that just comes with like growing up. My ex, Nyx, whatever. And the color cold brew. Alright, so here's the reality. I'm gonna lay on my couch and if I accidentally fall asleep and I take a nap. Things happen. The earth still spins. Um, good morning. Oh, so yesterday I basically just like talked and did my makeup with you guys and like got dressed for the day to literally like, I sat down to read I passed out something about putting makeup on me or something. I don't know my sleep is like really weird right now because I get really tired I get really tired at night and I go to bed earlier than I have ever and then I'll wake up between six and eight and it's like not enough but I have to wake up at like seven something to let Loki out. So I just stay up and I make breakfast. But like, it's like nine, it's like nine, almost 9.45. I'm so tired, like so incredibly tired. Like I must not be getting enough sleep. I don't know, like I crash in the middle of the day. And like, I used to not take naps because I used to wake up between like 9, 30, 10. And that was like good for me. And I wouldn't nap. Now I'm napping throughout the day. But that's what basically happened to me yesterday. I ended up crashing, napping for like almost embarrassingly like three hours. So bad. I had like, but like, I don't like taking naps too much because like yesterday I woke up and I didn't feel like filming because I had that like after nap, you know, taste in my mouth. You feel like still groggy, like you still don't feel like rested. Like if anything, you feel more tired. Um, yeah, it was just like not fun. But today is a new day. I'm gonna try and stay up more okay Loki. i'm gonna go get ready for a w-a-l-k you can't spell so you don't know what that says let me go get ready you be a good boy okay <laughs> yeah i'm just gonna go take him for a walk his morning walk um it's freezing just opening my blinds. Let's open the door. Oh, there's a bunch of golfers. Okay. Please don't look at me. It's super freaking cold. Okay. All right. I'm gonna get ready for the day. Of course, when I put makeup on, I kind of broke out. They're such dads. You hear the men. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it cracks me up. 
I'm gonna put on my favorite SPF on, it's the Elta MD. It has an SPF of 46, love it. I'm trying to prevent the aging process. <laughs> Cause I feel like I'm like literally like, I'm at that age like where like, I'm still kind of look prepubescent <laughs> and I need to take advantage of that and like take care of my skin while I still look like this, you know? So. Sunscreen, it is. Sorry for my messy room. I'm pretty sure I've worn this on here. I got this bodysuit from Aritzia. I got it for Christmas, but yeah. It's the Aritzia bodysuit. It's smooth like butter. Um, it really just... And it's light. It's not... I. It's the long one. But I just want something that can like show my shoulders so I can get some sun up here. You know what I'm saying? The UV is only like 5 right now, which is perfect for me. I don't... My, I can't sit in the sun very long, but I also don't like wearing SPF everywhere like on my face like yeah like hands neck so when i tan i don't usually put spf on because i'm only out there for like 15 minutes tops and or it like depends on the uv like if the uv is like 10 like i literally am out there for 10 minutes like five minutes on the front five minutes on the back and then i'm like done um and i i don't usually burn like i get a little red but i don't usually like whatever let me give my lips a little color because I'm looking a little a zombie. Let me put on this, my Laneige. Hey, now I just need my headphones, my tennis shoes, and obviously the dog. Okay, let's go. Look who's waiting. Look who's waiting. Hello, sir. Are you ready to go for a walk? Are you ready to go for a walk? Yeah? Are you ready to go for a walk? Okay, come on. Come on. Let's go. I'm also, when I come back, I want to watch the new um, Apple movie with... Chris Evans in Ana de Armas. It's called Ghosted. I think she's like a spy or something and he's like their boyfriend, her boyfriend or something. Okay, hair will be out of my face. I hate when I'm on a walk and hair flies to my face. But this will be good. Let me chug some water. Take a seat, look. Take a seat, 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 take a seat,